Hi Geeks and welcome to the 10 forumscom This video will show you how to use and set up the two-step verification to protect your Microsoft account. If you don't have a Microsoft account already, you can create one at www.outlook.com. You can use your existing third-party email address to create an MS account. This new MS account can then be used to sign in to any Microsoft services and to Windows 8 or later. If you want to get a new email address for your MS account, you can select either an Outlook.com or a Hotmail.com domain. To set up two-step verification, click the settings icon at top right and select options. Now select account details under the title managing your account. If asked, confirm your password. Select Security and Privacy and select Manage Advanced Security. You will now be asked to provide a security code which will be sent to one of the security contacts you provided when signing up for an MS account. Select your preferred method to get the code, a text message, a call or an email message.
can set up an authenticator app for your smartphone now if you want to. For the purpose of this video we will set it up later. If not already done, verify your security email address. Click Verify. A security code will be sent to selected email address. Enter the code you received. You can add additional security contacts, both phone numbers and email addresses. When adding a phone number, you can select if you want to receive codes as text messages or as voice calls. Remember that it is your responsibility to keep your security information up to date. If the phone number and email addresses no longer exist when a security code is needed, you will be locked out from your MS account for 30 days. To gain access to an account after the lockout can be difficult, sometimes impossible. It is never Microsoft's fault when this happens, you can only blame yourself. The security is there to protect your privacy. You must keep the security information up to date. Okay, let's continue. Select Setup two-step verification and thereafter click Next. Setting up a smartphone authentication app is not necessary, although recommended. If you will only use two-step verification with a security email or text messages, you can skip this step by clicking Set it up later. Open the app on your phone. Press the plus sign in app to add your MS account. And press the camera icon and scan the code from the PC display. Enter the code generated by the app, click Next. Copy and print or save the recovery code, click Next. Click Next, click Finish.
using the MS account first time on a new Windows PC or browser, the code will be asked. For each browser, you can select if the browser will remember you and only ask the code this one time or if it will always be asked.